Good morning, everyone. Oh my god, I'm so tired. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another vlog. It is Monday morning. It's 8.50 a.m. I just had my first one-hour consultation with Dr. Will Cole. It was fabulous. That's my new word after this weekend, guys. I had the best, like, four days in so long. It was the best weekend ever. So much fun. With that being said, I am so tired this morning. Even though I got a lot of sleep last night, I just, I don't know, guys. This red is killing my neutral vibe in the vlog. It was a fabulous weekend, so much fun, um, and we are back to work. This week is the live show, so we've got, oh, we have that meeting today, oh my gosh. Here we are. I was really like looking forward to making a latte this morning, and then I realized that I didn't have milk for it, so. And by milk, I mean like fake milk, but. I'm gonna order my groceries. I'm gonna get to work. I need to submit this week's podcast episode. I have meetings. Um, I'm not gonna film today. I'm gonna do that tomorrow. We have our live show. I need to edit a vlog. I need to post that. Um, I'm really excited. I can check off one thing so far. 8 a.m. meeting with Dr. Will Cole. I always plan everything in my Google Calendar and then I have a notes app thing of my week and then I have to-dos for each day and it's kind of like roughly laid out into my schedule and like that's what works for me the best also this week's episode is actually with dr will Colum. we like to separate mental health from physical health but actually mental health is physical health our brain is part of our body we can't separate the two inflammation impacts the brain just like it impacts your joints just like it impacts your stomach it's just like it impacts your thyroid or whatever else we're talking about it's really interesting i love hearing from different people's perspectives um i really like holistic health and medicine and like obviously i'm like so passionate and interested in health like there's so many random things that i feel like as i've gotten older i have like very specific interest whether it's like neuroscience reading um honestly overall health so i guess neuroscience goes into that um getting into investing things like that you know also the new couch fabulous everyone everything is just so fabulous these days but if you guys are new here be sure to subscribe welcome to another vlog if you guys want to see me an hour ago i was so dead so tired and now oh by the way i bought a new um print for back here and like I don't know if it's gonna be it. I really liked it online and the more I think about it the more I'm like Is that it for me? I don't know. I don't know. My couch is still there. We still haven't donated that so it is what it is Gonna get to work this morning guys Um, this is where I keep my podcast stuff in one of Dom's totes because she was taking it and we just like kept keeping it in here So I'm gonna record the intros and ads for this week's episode if you guys haven't listened to my podcast what the heck are you doing? So this is my Monday morning so far. It's really beautiful. Dom just brought me La La Land. <laughs> Good. Okay. So Gary, you could just make a, a slideshow real quick between with yeah. the, the two slides and the music going on at the beginning. Updated logo for the Hey Besties in, or do you know what what is the font? So. guys we just finished our meeting dom is here here's a little mini grocery haul um i got avocados and onions when i put them away kale broccoli got some almond milk cold brew my favorite pasta hummus my favorite pasta sauce balsamic glaze again they gave me bagels when i met bread so i need to go to the store salmon tomatoes eggplant cucumber pretty much what I always get, honestly. Just made my go-to meal. I'm making book club reels or just book rec reels currently. I was watching Lexi's vlog and just like, look how beautiful and peaceful the space feels. It's now 6 p.m. I'm done with work for the day. Huh, Fitzy? Yes. Oh my God, I'm in love with you. You are so perfect. You are so perfect. It's Monday night, so my cousin is coming over and bringing ramen soon. It's our Monday night tradition. But I got new boxes for the garage, for the shelves, so it's a little bit less cluttered. So I need to go organize those right now. This is the before. I just have got to get this together. It needs to be done. Okay, I just said this in 10 minutes. This is what we're doing for the time being. Eventually, that stuff's going to hopefully fit in there. These are actually bigger even than the big ones that I had that I didn't realize, but it's convenient to have. So hopefully, yeah, this will all fit and work, but it feels a lot better already. Looks 
so rainy and gloomy out in this. I know I always just show you the couch, but it's just so cozy. What rug should I get for under here when the ottoman gets here? I don't know. Honestly, I'm kind of into the whole rugless look, but I don't know. There's what I want for this table are unfortunately so expensive, so I'm trying to find a dupe. Oh, I just love my house, guys. It's just so cozy. Anyways, happy Tuesday morning. There are some mornings, or really just some phases of my life where I wake up and I'm wide awake, no problem. Oh, my cute little <coughs> Chamberlain mug. I'm so tired. There are some phases of life where I wake up early and I have energy. And like recently, it has been so difficult for me to get up in the morning. Like 8 a.m. is like the hardest thing, which is like really late for me. It's not been fun. I finally got ready. I have a meeting in four minutes. I have a podcast to record for my own. I'm going on another podcast. And then what else? I'm supposed to film potentially today. I've clearly pulled the lighting out. Um, so, oh, you know what? This could be a cute little setup if I, you know what it makes me, oh, no. Okay, it makes me want to film a video, which I actually need to do anyways. But I'm recording this morning with Emily DiDonato. Um, she was the face of Maybelline. For, I think she still might be for like 12 years. Um, she's a big time model. You guys would definitely recognize her face, but she just came out with the skincare line and she is like the sweetest girl ever. I'm so excited for us to like actually record together. So that's happening in 20 minutes. I'm getting everything set up. I'm gonna try this background. Like I wish that my kitchen wasn't in the background here because I do like this setup. I feel like so professional right now. I got this from Zara this weekend and I wore it and it was super cute. It's a large, I wish I would have gotten an XL. It's all Dom's fault. Dom told me to get a large and I wish I would have gotten an XL, you know? Oh, I just made a coffee and I loved it. Barely any time. Emily, I just have to say, your life, I don't know if you realize this, but with the combination of you meeting your husband on a plane and you actually legitimately getting scouted at the mall, it's like a YA like fiction novel that everyone wants to live. That's actually so funny that you say that. I could actually see all of that happening in like a young adult novel for sure. Um, yeah, I've definitely had an interesting journey and gotten very lucky in many scenarios, I feel. I just finished recording. Emily is an angel, love her. Um, but I'm just having one of those moments where I'm like, why am I wearing makeup? I feel like gross. It's also like really gloomy and rainy outside. It does not feel like summer. So anyways, I'm just importing some footage. I have another recording in about 45 minutes. Finally finished recording for the day. I cannot wait to take my makeup off. I recorded for the Water and Whiskey podcast. So I'll share that on my Instagrams when it goes live. It was so good. We talked a lot about books, honestly. Like I hope that um, their listeners don't think I'm really boring, but we literally went on about it forever. I don't know. It is thunderstorming outside. I feel like my house looks so much cozier in person than it does on camera. I'm wearing my Amazon set. Does anyone else wear like the same workout sets because like you do your laundry and then you just put the clean clothes on top and then you just keep grabbing the clean clothes on top of the in your dresser drawers and then you just end up wearing the same stuff even though you have a bunch of other stuff? Yeah. Here I am on my couch that I haven't gotten rid of yet. It is pouring outside. I feel so bad because like the dogs literally cannot go outside. Like it is pouring. Like an umbrella isn't gonna do anything. Like it's really, really bad. What do you do if you live in like a really rainy climate and you need to take your dogs outside but it rains 24 seven, like pours? Like this is pouring. This isn't just like a, oh, like get an umbrella. I should be laying out on my rooftop reading this afternoon. That's what I should be doing after I am done with work, but so what's happening today. Here we are in the gym. Again, I feel like everything looks better in person than it does on camera, but I keep saying I'm gonna suffer this and I keep forgetting I need to. Here's the couch finally cleaned off. We've got this stuff. Pretty much, it's a lot more organized than it was. Um, oh, I also got a 25 pound kettlebell, dumbbell, whatever. Um, that's gonna be interesting. I got that in the mail yesterday. I'm currently doing laundry. I'm watching Brooke's vlog right now. About to do 12, 3.30 and then um, a leg workout, I think. So that's the plan. It's crazy, but it's still the story of Consuelo Vanderbilt. Favorite lunch is eggplant under there. You can't see. I made it yesterday. I make it all the time. I don't know why I've been showing you guys. Obviously, you know, but this is what I crave like 24 7. It is so good. You guys want to see how I make it? It's on my Instagram reels. 
I can't tell if I like love or hate this setup, but I just got out of the shower. I've just been working on the couch. I've actually been doing a ton of emails and planning for my LA recordings. I'm going to LA next month to hopefully record like eight episodes. So been trying to schedule that. Hello Fitzy, how are you doing dude? As you guys know, it has been pouring all day. It's finally chilled out a little bit, but I am so tired. Tomorrow is the live show, which is exciting. So it's gonna be a really big day. So I just really wanted to chill tonight. I just stored off some sushi and watching YouTube videos and I am going to be done working. I know you, deja vu. <gasps> Wow, is this our playlist for the show? Uh, yes and yeah. no. <laughs> this is a playlist I thought I could just use a Spotify playlist, but then I just sent them songs. You know you could have just used a Spotify playlist, I told you that. Well, that's what I asked him and he was like, oh, like Gary was like, oh, just send, send the, them over. Yeah, and I was like. My hair today actually really hurts. You know when like, actually, I don't think anyone's gonna understand this, but sometimes like, it's not even like, it's like so tender right here. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. Okay, anyways, hello. Happy show day, everyone. Show time, show time. Okay. It's show time, everyone. We are going to our new favorite coffee shop, White Rhino. White um, Rhino Plasti. Should we start calling it that? Yeah. Guys, I do I'll this thing where like, it. I have to be best friends with everyone of like any place I go to regularly. Same. And now that I've decided that this is like my regular spot, I have to be like best friends with everyone here. So updates to come. Yeah. But if you're in Dallas, it's an uptown. It's two stories. I made a TikTok of it last week, but it's so cute. Uh, Michelle literally texted me today and was like, "Where should I go work?" And I'm like, "Right, right now." But I guess you know it's been raining. It's so cute. Look at Dom. Oh, guys, Dom got a new car. She's the driver now. I've served my time. The nodding donkey. The nodding Throwing donkey. it back. Throwing it back. Got a beautiful ice matcha latte with oat milk. And the most beautiful sandwich ever. We got it this weekend. It's like a maple, what? It's a maple bacon, I don't even know, breakfast sandwich, breakfast tacos. It's so good, guys. We're trying to change one of our segments to a truth or drink instead of a fill, spill your guts, fill your guts. Hi, Queen. Hi. Hi, how's it going? Good. Great. We have Quick a question. question. Yes. So like what are your thoughts on us changing it to truth or drink instead of spill your guts, fill your guts? Or it, it could it doesn't have to change the format, just like we're taking shots instead of eating gross food. Yeah, I mean I think either works. I think whatever is easiest for you guys like the flow of the show. I mean, Dom is a picky eater, so <laughs> Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. You see, I just I, it would be too hard to find was, things she would eat. We can keep the name. Okay, so now that that's approved, we need to get limes. Done. Got our stuff. We have something very exciting to show you. Cute. How cute, guys. So cute. Isn't it so cute? Looks just like us, everyone. <gasps> it's so cute. I'm gonna use mine like every day. I know, it's I'm so I'm actually cute. gonna use my face. And you could actually fit it around your, your arm. But there's nothing worse than when you can't fit something in your arm. That's really cute. You know when a tote's too small? Yes. Perfect size. R.I.P. that. Hey, I'm getting ripped tonight. Baby's breath, my favorite. Also, of course I'm gonna be a florist. Yay. Did you see me like knowing what I was doing when I was taking out my flowers? Yeah. It's cause I took a floral class. Don't mind, don't forget, don't mind. You knew what you were doing, girly. I did. Okay, we're gonna go take some pics. Goodbye. I literally hate my life so much. Like, please, no one ever talk to me again, ever. Are you kidding? I hate my life. That's the culprit right there. Bye, everyone. And I'm gonna take a nap now. Oh, this little angel. Well, um, makeup has arrived. Eden Young is doing our makeup. She's so sweet. I'll have her Instagram down below. I just did my hair and I'm wearing her shirt. Um, my jeans are drying right now, so just in some sweat shorts. But I just curled my hair. I never really curl it anymore because I always use my air off. But just wanted to try something different today. And then here is our funny merch shirt. This is just like a fun early 2000s um, inspired like tour t-shirt. So they are available. You guys can buy this shirt and the besties toe. I would be really honored if you did, um, but it's so cute. I did create these. 
No. Oh, wait, I, can't I can't see them. I can't see it. You can't see it. It's you. Anyway, oh, it's me. Yeah. Gonna pop, they're just going to pop up the same way. I've been, I'm not going to get sensitive. No, I will say Kenzie's were a little, little lighter than yours, Bob. <gasps> really? <laughs> I literally have a propeller hat on. <laughs> Drives me insane. Look at us, we're matching. We just got our makeup done. Let me show you my outfit. Ignore all the furniture in the background. You can't see that on the show. My favorite jeans that I always wear, a cute bestie shirt. I'm wearing a size large, um, super cute. And then my Nike blazers. And uh, here we are. Um, we have already, well we have sound check and like, wait. We have sound check. Okay, my God, we have sound check in like 15 minutes, 10 minutes. We're gonna on this show. We already have our drink ready for the truth or drink segment, which is fill your guts, fill your guts. But Dom is gonna take her first tequila shot. Actually, no, you're doing it in the vlog, right? Because we're gonna take one shot before the show. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So we're working on that. Um, I will get that documented. Don't worry. Dom's first tequila shot. I'm really excited to share this moment that like means so much to me. I hate my pants got unbuttoned. And like I'm just so happy to have you guys along for the journey. That is again Dom's first tequila shot. Don't mind me. It's a really big deal. I'm so scared. You might want to get a drink. So this is my These are not these are very small shot glasses, by the way. Those are small? Yes. Have you what shot glasses have you seen before? A red solo cup. Okay. Why does that make my like taste buds like tingle? Costa Migos is like a really good tequila. Fun fact: George Clooney sold this in 2017 for a billion dollars. So, and you'll understand why because this bottle itself was 50. So, congrats, George. Happy for you, I guess. Hey, George. I, honestly, I'm like really not feeling shots tonight for once, and um. You might get a lot out of me. Okay, so when you take a tequila shot, you chase it with like a lime. Okay, so what does it help? So you chase- This is why you're afraid to do a truth to drink because you've never taken a shot before. That's why you didn't want to do it. It wasn't because of the drinking thing. It's because you've never taken a tequila shot. Guys, if this video, if this vlog gets 200 comments, Don will do a truth or drink with me. So I just- Maybe. I mean, you should have come to the live show, um, but- we'll The live show is going to be some juicy- The live tea. show is going to be something. Okay, so- you drink. I'll give you which one has less. They're Fork. the exact same. Okay, so you drink and then eat this. Like if you want, go before and after. I normally just like. Okay. I'll do whatever you want to do. Okay. Because well, you're gonna have to follow. Do you want to have a little bit before? No, it's okay. Really? Okay. Oh. So when you take a shot, you cheers and then you go down and then take it out. <laughs> I can't believe you. minutes until sound check everyone you, oh my oh my god you didn't even drink the shot yes, I did. <laughs> yeah, you, did. you just spit it all out that was really something Dom, that was my childhood just oh. how like, you just killed i'm so sorry oh my god just kidding i was a tito's girl growing up by growing up i mean late teens oh, still not good not good at all we should have got fireball i feel it in my heart the reason this weekend was so rough was because we had beer, oh, or I had beer, and then we did the fireball shot. That's oh. what happened. Mm. Wait, was that fireball shot your first shot ever? No. Good with Colin? No? I guess it's my first real shot. Wow. You are so much more wholesome than me. No, I- You would think that I'm the more wholesome one out of us two as well. But the thing is, is when we were younger, I, by the first time I like really drank drank, like in high school, I did like shots of vodka. Oh my god, you didn't even take the shot, I just poured it out. 
And on, on the show, I will give you half a shot. On the show, I'm answering every question. Like, it's literally sitting in my heart right now. Okay, I'll give you, what if I give you like half of it? You have to take one shot on the show. Okay, fine. You have to take one. So you're gonna have to choose one question. Okay. Okay, we're playing JoJo, but Dom. Now, do you have more respect for me that I'm like a wizard with shots? Yes, bro. Like now, are you no. like, oh my god, Kenzie, you're so powerful and cool no, and pretty like, and awesome? No, how the fork did you do that? It's just, it is what it is, Dom. That's honestly what happens when you grow up in the great state of Texas. All right, guys, we're going into sound check, and then the show is gonna start. Will you um pull the run of show on your phone, or I can't because my phone's on um the charger. Here we are. Sound check. Sound check. <sighs> wow, I'm ready. Oh, into a broadcast studio. I just wish the lighting was like how it was before. Same. It's tragic. <gasps> All right, guys, we just we just finished the show. How do you feel? I feel like it went really well, and everyone in the meet and greets told us that We're, it was like really good. Everyone so, like, in the meet and greets. If you're watching this, I just want to say I love you guys so much. Like, yes, I wish we could have a besties meetup. Well, we like want to, so. But like, you know how like people on the internet would be like, meet at Central Park. Like, I wish we could do that. Like, that'd be I so know. fun. Well, Dom's never done like a legitimate meet and greet. I have You started this during COVID. I started during. That's COVID. the stuff that's like crazy. Yeah. You guys started standing me in COVID. Oh my god. Well, that was like really, that really was cool. So fun. And, and like, also, I had to take all the shots of tequila, and Dom literally for all of hers took half of a shot. Yeah, because you. Okay, so you I'm ready to go out. You poisoned me with acid. Acid? Are you kidding? No. I actually I'm not. need to not go out. I need to like go to bed, but that's just, it's like only 9 p.m. I mean, my Instagram is popping right now. Might I just add? Anyways, it was just so good. If you guys came to the show, thank you guys so much. Like, what an incredible experience! Literally the best experience ever. It like could I could cry. I could, I could genuinely cry. cry. I'm putting our the seats back so I can clean my house. Oh, yeah. Um. Even though, like, Dom can't take a tequila shot, like, I am glad that you're my best friend, but, like, I, like, we have to work on that. We're this gonna summer. have to work on that this summer because I'm pretty sure to get on some, you know, when I lie and say I'm a Republican to get on a boat, <laughs> I feel like that's gonna be one of the qualifications. It's, it's like, gonna be, well, honestly, Cheetos is, like, a big thing here, too. Cheetos is probably easier for you to take. I don't know. I don't know. I can do them all. I'm just so Texan, so, like, it's and fine, but we're working on it with you. I think they'll be able to get there, you know? Yeah. Well, that is the end of this week in my life vlog because I'm going to take tomorrow kind of off of vlogging, not off of working. And then Friday starts my weekend of my life vlog. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We had, like, legitimately the best time. It was just so fun. But we love you guys, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Well, let's talk about that because here's the thing about over-delivering. You know, usually, and you're...